Shut your arse, twig spine. <clears throat> Stand fast. This will be over soon. Worry not for me. You must stop. <clears throat> Silence, fool. So this is what it comes to, Wolfkist? Two Danes fighting over a filthy Saxon whore, son? This swine is your prize. Come and uh, get him. Uh. Keep uh. focused. Guard them. <laughs> the people of East Anglia have spoken. Give yourself over. Take a prisoner to a Saxon. To you, never! You think yourself above the Danes? The Saxon loves to come to fight. This battle is not yet won, Oswald. A miserable clan you lead, Ruid. Yes, and one that has bled this country dry for two summers. should be ruled, Wolfkist. Made thralls, not treated as equals. We are better than this, than all of them. Do not drag me down to the sewers you wallow in. That groveling worm in a cage. You must be blind to stand with such a man. Ah, for yeah. all your efforts, only the cold dark of Niflheim awaits you. Valhalla is my destiny. That fate will not be met to me. Why does a Dane fight tooth and nail for a Saxon? This Saxon of all! He has an abundance that which you do not! Thank you. You'd throw in with these wastrels, these Argir swine? For what? A scrap of land and a promise of peace? Eivor, no! He should be tried before God, a lawful assembly. <laughs> I won't have my reign begin with more blood spilt than is needed. Another screeching skull. This man must die for the damage he has wrought. The old laws are clear. These are Oswald's lands. To rule as king as he sees fit. Does Eivor bow to kings? To defy a king would shame him. East Anglia cannot heal without his honor intact. And what of your honor, Eivor? How much are you willing to lose? The rightful king of East Anglia has spared your life today, and so it will be. Compassion is a virtue suited for anyone, Eivor, including you. Thank you. Speak with Oswald. See if he's well. 
Thank you for heeding me, Eivor. I know the worth of such a gesture. All this is... is like a dream. But you are not asleep. Well fought! Well fought! The both of you! You came as well, old friend. If I'd known you were still alive, I would have stayed in Norwich. Look around you. A happy occasion and a glorious victory. And soon, something more grand to take place. Our wedding, my love. If you will still have me, that is. And why would I not? I fought poorly. I melted under the heat and anger of that brute. And I never... Oswald, stop. You fought with all your heart and soul. That's all you need ever do. Come then. We have much to prepare for. A bride to wed and a kingdom to lead. What some men wouldn't give for such things. Countless men have died for them. And you, Vanir? Are you jealous of such things? Hardly. My heart is afire, but my body aches. I desire only a long nap. I saw a bale of hay back there. Later, Abel. For now I must see to the wounded. Then I will see you at the wedding. Aye, of course you will. I should return to Elmenham. Oswald's wedding will soon begin. Dress our guests, and I'd like you to be there. It's been a worthy ceremony so far. And have you had enough fun yet? I'm ready to hear you address your kingdom. Good. Come, come. Join me. Friends, honored guests, we've pushed through hard times. It seems like all we've known is loss and suffering. But it is not conflict that binds us. It is compassion. May we always favor compassion, even when our enemies refuse its boon. So to my Dane friends and neighbors, I give thanks for the bravery you have shown during our collective struggles. And for my fellow Christians, may we continue standing as examples of our Lord's grace. Lights in the dark. I see East Anglia's future right here, right now, in all of you, Dane and Saxon alike. To our future. Still a bit soft on insults, but the king has courage. And to Eivor, without whom none of this would have been possible. On behalf of East Anglia, let this ring be proof of our loyalty to the Raven Clan and all they have done for us today. Would you have any words of wisdom for us? Oswald, you would not have been my first choice as king, nor my second. I thought you weak, bendable, without resolve. But not all men are as they first appear. I came to see that Oswald's heart is amongst the largest I've ever known. He is sturdy, he has wisdom, and he has courage. All qualities of a man worthy to be king. He is the king East Anglia deserves and the king you need. To the good King Oswald! To Oswald! Skull! 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 Okay, everyone, the bridal race starts now. Remember, you all have to lose to the bride and groom. Steady all, and ready yourself for the wedding race. The king and his bride against all! My king, he... <laughs> the sheep you left to guard me have been shorn. Oswald, king of sheep fuckers, show your eyes. I challenge you. I accept. No square, only sweat and blood. He may be wounded, but don't let your guard down. 
Let's settle this. I will bury you, Saxon. I'll take all that is yours. Should a king show mercy to one so malevolent, so cruel? I'll not give you the satisfaction of a good death, for my god forbids such cruelty. Therefore, you are outcast. From this moment on, you have won. My life is yours. Your life is God's. <laughs> now go! Leave my kingdom and never return! I do not understand this Saxon religion. Oswald is a coin. One side mercy, the other courage. There are few like him, I'll admit. Saxon or Dane. Such a strange display. Courage and restraint like I've never seen. With all that's happened, with all the chaos ruined wrought, still Oswald found reason to spare him. It's a strange thing. A remarkable thing. From what inner spring does such kindness run? I'd like to know. With my duty here fulfilled, I now choose East Anglia. I fight for you, my king. Prize, old friend. You're embarrassing me. Be well, Finir. Your choice is a bold one. You continue to surprise Oswald of Ilmenham. Thank you, Eivor. When we first met, I made an oath. I promised you an alliance. You did. You'll have it. So long as I draw breath. Until next time, King. Yeah. All this. Will you not stay a moment longer, Eivor? I should not linger. My banner folk await my return. I understand. Take care, Valdis. You fought well, and won yourself a worthy king. I did, didn't I? Take care, Eivor. Now it seems the wind calls me back to Randvi. Let's tell her the good news. Uh, a dream come true, like none other. Thank you for everything. From the bottom of my heart. Brodia, Eivor, you will be missed. I gave you a few good memories to keep. <laughs> that you did. Take care of your king, Brodia. He will need you in the years to come. Brother, Oswald is in your hands now. Protect your king, and call out to my banner should the need arise. Aye, Eivor. Without a moment's hesitation, travel safe. I will, friend. It's good that Oswald married a Dane. I'm tired. Oswald is king, and a king must have a champion. I will fight in his stead. He challenged me, Eivor. Your fight is bigger than this, Lord. You must rebuild East Anglia plank by plank. And a dead king cannot keep his oaths. Let me finish this. Oswald, you gutless Arius swine! I'll slay the wolf kissed, then hang you with your own tongue. You! Always getting in the way! Yeah!
wish it had not come to this. So much death, so much anger. What's done is done. You're leaving now. I should. Your wedding should be a day of peace and happiness. Today I lack both. Eivor, you've done East Anglia a great service. I promised you an alliance, and now you have it. And one day, I will need you to make good on that alliance. I should find Finia. Say goodbye before I leave. Ah, greetings, Eivor. You're missing the festivities. I've had my fill. It's as much yours as it is Oswald's. I was a crumbling man, Eivor. Before all this, I thought I'd die a tired old failure. But now, my heart burns bright with newfound fire. I want to live hard, die fierce. Glory cares not for age, Finir. Sail with me. My ship could always use a wise head and a strong axe. Together? Together. I'll gather my things. He deserves death, Oswald. That's our way. Eivor, please! <laughs> Blood for blood leaves no warmth in the hearts of men, Eivor. None at all. Speak with Oswald. See if he's well. Naval! To the ships! Saxon and Dane. We fought well, side by side. If there is to be a future for both our kind, people like you and me will have to change the most to live within it. Even if that makes us uneasy. When you're crowned king, the laws of this land will be yours to decide. All this is... is like a dream. But you're not asleep. Well fought, well fought, the both of you! You came as well, old friend. If I'd known you were still alive, I would have stayed in Norwich. Look around you. A happy occasion and a glorious victory. And soon, something more grand to take place. Our wedding, my love. If you will still have me, that is. And why would I not? I fought poorly. I melted under the heat and anger of that brute. And I never... Oswald, stop. You fought with all your heart and soul. That's all you need ever do. Come then. We have much to prepare for. A bride to wed and a kingdom to lead. What some men wouldn't give for such things. Countless men have died for them. And you, Vinir? Are you jealous of such things? Hardly. My heart is afire, but my body aches. I desire only a long nap. I saw a bale of hay back there. Later, Abel. For now I must see to the wounded. Then I will see you at the wedding. Aye, of course you will. I should... Scorn! Okay, everyone, the bridal race starts now. Remember, you all have to lose to the bride and groom. Quick, brother! We can't lose to Oswald.
Must you win at everything? <laughs> It was a beautiful wedding, Oswald. Like you said it would be. Thanks to you, and everything you've done here. It won't be easy putting the pieces of East Anglia back together. But you won't be alone. Saxon and Dane have banded together in your name. You are the right man for the throne, and they'll be with you. Thank you, Eivor. I don't know what to say. When we met, I spoke of an alliance. Will you hold to the oath you made? I will. Consider East Anglia a friend of the Raven Clan. There will be a day when I come calling. Goodbye, friend. Until next time, Great King. I should find Finia. Say goodbye before I leave. Ah, greetings, Sabor. You're missing the festivities. I've had my fill. It's as much yours as it is Oswald's. I was a crumbling man, Eivor. Before all this, I thought I'd die a tired old failure. But now, my heart burns bright with newfound fire. I want to live hard, die fierce. Glory cares not for age, Finir. Sail with me. My ship could always use a wise head and a strong axe. Together? Together. I'll gather my things. <laughs> <laughs>